Annie Jo here with Annie Jo Sews. So today I'm going to show you a bunch of Bucilla and other maker stockings um, that are going to be available in my store on eBay and on Etsy. Um, they're, most of them are vintage, they're all hand sewn, never any glue or issues or craziness like that. So this first one that I have is called Christmas Cherubs. It's from 1991 and as you can see it's just adorable. Condition is fabulous. There we go, no issues. Um, very cute little design. Okay. Second one I have here is a 1950s Santa's engine. I think the kit number is 8239. And this is from the 50s, late 50s, early 60s. It is very heavy felt. Um, I actually have a little article about this stocking on my website, um, thepapercrafter.com, and you can check it out. Again, available in my store. The next one I have is called Nativity, and this is from 2013, and the kit number for this one is 86449, and this is just fantastic. As you can see here, I'm not real good at doing this, so you'll just have to bear with me a little bit. I want you to be able to see it all um, in condition how it looks. Everything's in really great shape. A little bit of a close-up for you there. And that is the Nativity. So the next one I have is the Ultimate Fan. This is Santa Claus watching football. It's kit number 86504. And this one, if you wanted to put your name or somebody's name on the tag, you're able to do so. This one turned out really, really well. He's got a cup of hot cocoa with some peppermint and all the football accoutrements down at the bottom. Back looks great too. And there we go. Again, this is ultimate fan football Santa. Okay, next one is another sport Santa and this is um, the baseball Santa. This is a 2000 year kit and the kit number is 84260. And here's this one, Santa 1, Snowman 0. Also, this is one of the harder to find kits. They recently made the um, Snowman Baseball or Baseball Snowman, but they no longer make the Baseball Santa. All right, next one is the Procession. Very rare stocking. Um, they stopped making this in 2007. So this is obviously a 2000 model. Um, and it is just immaculate. You can see all the detail work and sequins and beads. Everything is just about perfect on here. And there's the back. And you can see. There we go. And again, this is a procession. This is available in my store um, on Etsy and on eBay. And I'm going to link down in the comments, or I'm sorry, in the description where you can find these. This next one is the Holy Family, kit number 83385, and also super well done. Lots of detail, just perfect condition as you can see. And there we go. All right, and the next one is Watching Over Me, and that is a two thousand. this one's a 2004 model, kit number 85105. This one I just made available in my store, I think, last night. And here you go. You can probably tell by this video I'm not a stocking display expert. Never be accused of being called Banna White. But here we go. <laughs> Next one is the Two Turtle Dove Stocking. And this one, 2016. This one is actually lined, as you can see there. Oh, let me see. I think I have another one that's lined that I might have missed showing you. Um, 2016, and it's kit number 86662. Two turtle doves right here. Back looks great. And while you're checking that out, I am going to see the one that I think is lined. Hmm. I think the nativity one might be lined. Let's see here. I could be totally wrong. Yep, I'm totally wrong. Okay. All right. That's two turtle doves. And this one is another super hard to find stocking. This is a fishing Santa. I believe it's vintage 2000, might be sooner, might be the 90s. 
kit number 83658. And his little fishies move. See that little fishies? Little lures there move. And then if you lift his fish up, you can see underneath says Merry Christmas. And fuzz again. Okay, so this one's a 1998. I forgot. This one had the um, crafter's signature on it. 1998. And the next one is the Santa Chef. And that is, this is 2007, also a really hard to find model that they discontinued. And the kit number is 85435. And it's got little floppy things hanging around that you would use in a kitchen, an oven mitt, a uh, flipper thingy, and then a frying pan. This looks really, really super nice, as you can see. And we'll flip it over. And there's the back. And again, that is the Chef Santa stocking. These are all Bucilla, by the way. I do have one other maker um, that I'll tell you about. So this is the piece de resistance, whatever that fancy schmancy French word is. This is a Bucilla Trio Nutcracker, stock, Nutcracker Trio stocking. Um, it's kit number 86061. And this was made in 2007 and then discontinued after a couple months. No idea why it was actually discontinued. And this is an absolutely fabulous stocking, extremely rare to find, and it is just about immaculate. And you notice I always say just about perfect, just about immaculate, because there could be something somewhere, a string out of place or something that I have missed. So I like to say 99.9999, you know how it is. Never say 100% because you may find like a, a, I don't know, a pin size thread out of whack or something. So, And here's the back of it. Looks great. And again, just a really super nice stocking extremely hard to find and immaculate. I think the kits for this go for $349 or so just for the kit. Okay. Here's Bowling Santa. Um, and he is kit number 86452. God, I can't read my own writing. Mm. Okay, so here he is bowling. He's got the bowl at the top. Little tag is a pin is a bowling pin. And you can see the uh, penguins are his bowling pins, I guess. And again on the back in great shape. And that's the bowling Santa. Also Bucilla. Those are all 18 inch stockings. This next one is a 16 inch stocking and this is called Picketry and it's 86440. So again, this is a slightly smaller stocking. It's called Picketry. It is not the tree shopping kit that's very similar. So there that one is. And then we have, I believe this is Moonlight Santa. Um, yeah, Moonlight Santa. And he's got little stars here on the tags where the tag would be. And this is kit number eight, six, what that say? Eight, six, zero, one, eight. Sorry. My husband is my assistant tonight. And I can't read. What year is that baby? 2007, 2007 for this particular kit. Moonlight Santa, and there we go. So what I did was I put sticky notes on all these so that you wouldn't have to watch me fumble around through a video to figure out what and remember when uh, the kit was made and all those sort of details. So he's helping me out. So it's a bit smoother for you to watch. You don't have to struggle <laughs> watching me go through this. So the last kit I have, well, actually next to the last kit, is a Dimensions Penguins Playing. And this one, I'm not super sure what the name is. It's something about penguins and they're playing. That's all I know. So very cute. Also available in my store. Um, again, this is a Dimensions 18-inch um, stocking. Or maybe it's Design Works. Dimension or Design Works. I don't know. It's in my store. So here's the last one that I have. And it's so big, I can't really get it into the thing. So we got to do it like this. So this is called Chock Full of Toys. It's a 1991 jumbo. And the kit number for this is 82. 913 and it is just huge. This one is 28 inches from tag to toe. And you can see the back here. Again, this is also available in the store on my website, Etsy and eBay and all that jazz. So there we go. That is my most recent lot of stockings um, that I wanted to share with you. I believe there are two left from the other video that I made. Um, all the other ones have been sold, 
So these again are available in my store on Etsy on my website, thepapercrafter.com. And I have put some of these up on eBay today. The rest will go up this weekend and they will be available. So lots and lots of fun um, stockings for you to check out. Anyway, thanks so much for watching my video. Have a great day.